presence of Brisbane is involved in several activities that we've done over the years, including blood drives, uh, raising funds for the Leukemia Foundation, but Crestwalk as an event is our flagship event and we've run this now for the last 10 years. Our main purpose is to foster a healthy lifestyle for our community and we do this by organising entertainment events, sporting events, cultural events. I think the main example I can give you for our sporting event is our annual Crest Walk. And originally the idea was to get all the Muslim communities, the different ethnic groups and the different cultures together. But it's gone much more than that over the years and, and now we, we actually embrace a whole variety of different ethnic groups. We've got the Middle Easterns, we've got the Eastern European um, and then the homegrown Australian. Um, I know like colleagues, like my mum's colleagues from her work, which who aren't Muslim, they all come along and they've met so many Muslims through Crestwalk. And it's not just the walk itself, it'll be like a carnival type atmosphere. We've got tug of war going on, there'll big be board slide, games. Yeah, a big uh, slide for climbing, the kids. Rock climbing. Rock climbing, yeah. We've got um, life-size board games such as your Scrabble and your chess and Connect Four and Jenga. So we're really going all out this year to make this the most epic Chris walk. We've got so many categories within there. We've got the pram and wheelchair races where someone was pushing a pram. We usually have set winners for those sort of things. There's a section of the community, a segment of the community that tries to nurture the spiritual aspect. Then you have a section, the academic Muslims, who try to nurture the intellectual aspect. And now you've got Chris Walk who says we want to nurture the physical aspect of the Muslim community. And if we can put them all together, that'll be a wonderful combination, I would say. Another important part of this event is actually uh, ensuring that people are able to uh, network with each other, uh, meet people along the route and then at the end of it to enjoy a lunch. It's not really fitness, it's more everyone's just there to have fun and food. And the food is the emphasis for the whole event, I must say. A lot of them say no, it's not about the food, but, but really it's about the food. It's just a social day. gathering. Yeah, yeah and I think for a good day. A lot of other organisations are a lot more serious, so Crescent's mm. very light-hearted, it's very relaxed, you know. We think this is a prime example of how other community organisations should work and operate and encourage communities to interact together through a fun day which encourages people to walk and mingle and play. This was our 10th anniversary and we had a great turnout. We had over close to 700 register. Everyone was here, had a great day. Brisbane weather put on uh, the best for the day and, and everyone had great fun, enjoyed themselves and are looking forward to another 10 years of Crescent's of Brisbane in Charlotte.